pedal power bicycle. It was one of many businesses in San Marcos, south of the downtown area near the convention center. But owner Tamara Piper says when they moved away from downtown and into this building in 2006, they were basically out in the boonies. When we first moved out here, people said, why'd you move out of town? Because there really wasn't much out here at that point. Piper and her husband were ahead of the curve. They knew the area would grow up around them. The, the reason for that was we knew that the Wonder World Extension was coming through, the Sam's building was going in, Target across the street, lots of development out this direction. Um, so as the town was growing, we, we saw the, the need to grow as well. For the third year in a row, the U.S. Census Bureau has declared San Marcos the fastest growing city in the country. Its population climbing 7.9 percent between 2013 and 2014 to reach around 58,900 people. So what's up with San Marcos? We're home to Texas State University, a growing uh, population. We're a very attractive city, place to live that's very affordable. After Thursday's census announcement, the subject was discussed at the 10th annual Greater San Marcos Economic Outlook at the convention center. Economist Ray Perryman was the honored guest. He says San Marcos is part of the Austin growth complex. People in general, you're seeing growth in the suburban areas around central cities. San Marcos has also developed its own industrial base of, of good technology-oriented clean industries. But with any major growth comes challenges, infrastructure, traffic, even water. It's keeping up with growth, uh, with challenges in transportation, uh, with challenges in, in housing development and, and, and infrastructure, making sure that we have a good water supply for a growing community and ensuring that we're able to attract good jobs, good paying jobs. Perryman says the great thing about growth is it provides resources to deal with those challenges. Yes, I, th I think this area on the whole has done a good job of planning that over time and, and being forward thinking and looking at it and working regionally when, they, when you need to work regionally to find solutions.